Hello there, and welcome back to another episode of the Alvarez family. All right, everyone. So today it's Sophia's birthday, I believe, right? It's Wednesday. Yep, it's Sophia's birthday and Halloween. As you can see, the house is decorated. We're not going to do like uh, loads on like of actual decorations on the outside. We'll get the pumpkin carving station for sure. We definitely need to get that. Uh, probably get a couple. I feel like we got enough money. Like we don't have loads of money. What is it? Took it long enough. Sorry, I just stopped talking because it took like 10 years for this to load. Yeah, I feel like we got enough money to actually be able to get some bits now. Also, hello. How are you? <laughs> Look at her face. Lana looks so worried. Okay, so pumpkin carving. This is cute stuff. Oh, These are really cute. Okay, so. Uh... Here it is. All right, so we'll get one here and one here. And then once the holiday is over, we'll either get rid of, we'll either sell them or just put them in our inventory. Cause let's be real, we could just do that. Uh, okay, so first of all, Sophia, are you ready for, no, you're not. Okay, so let's get this, let's get this filled up. You need to practice your cheer routine to make sure that you get promoted today. Okay, girl. All right. Um, she'll go to school once that's done. I'm not gonna follow them to school today. I just wanted to do some bits around the house. I want to focus on Alistair getting uh, the garden taken care of, and I also want to get this done and get them to get to the next level. Just and do some maintenance around the house because you know, like things can get messy a bit easy. Um, I've also gone ahead and replaced uh, the items that we were missing. Oh, it's Halloween, so they're not supposed to go to school. Well, I kind of want them to go to school, though. Because, obviously, in the last part, he went out and he's supposed to be, um, and, like, he's supposed to not be allowed to go out. But... Oh, he's actually having a rebellious phase, of course. Uh, but he's actually not, like, grounded or anything. So I think we're gonna have him quickly just run up to the toilet and then have him go to school and be like, oh, you are going to school. You know, like, you're not doing anything, but you are going to school. Can I go to school? Yeah. Oh my god, these, these, okay. These interesting interactions that they get. Uh, what's going on with you? Okay, have you clean up? Clean up? Everyone's just staying at home with the kids, I guess. Uh, what are you doing, sir? Well, I think we're gonna have him uh, carve a pumpkin. Why not, you know? Is this Bill's? Today's mail. Ooh, do we think it's um, her uni acceptance? Let's have a look. Let's see what we got in the mail. It could be. Sophia, you could be knowing your future right now. What are we getting? Uh-uh. It is it. University acceptance letter. This is very exciting. Very exciting moment, Sophia. We need to go to a better spot so we can actually see what you're doing. Uh, maybe here? Let's have her go there. Ooh, and we got... Wow. We actually got a lot of distinguished degrees. Good for her. Good for you, Sophia. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yes, exactly, girl. Okay, that's very exciting. So can we apply? Or do we have to wait? Let's see. University? Okay, we have to... Okay, we can do it once we age up. Okay, that's sick. All right, so let's have a... She's going to do a bit of research on University of Brightchester, because obviously that's the one that gave her so many, like, interesting things, uh, like, for the degrees that... Well, they gave her, like, all those, like, distinguished... What is it called? Degrees, I guess. Um, for the things that she really wants to study. So we're going to have a focus on that for sure. Uh, maybe you can come and stack a bit, Lizzie. Salvador, what are you doing? You got back to sleep. Okay, yeah. Matthew's at school. I think we're going to have him make some friends. 
he'll definitely be doing that kind of stuff instead of actually doing what needs to be done. Okay, so obviously we know all this. Um, and yeah, we got a good amount of these, didn't we? I think she will... No, she will definitely join the debate guild as well. So at least now she knows a little bit more about it. And she can start looking forward to it. Look at, that, look at her, well distinguished. Being accepted into a large number of distinguished degree programs as Sophia smiling. Oh, good for her. So happy for her. She's gonna FaceTime, not this, uh, social. She's gonna do a little video call with Juan to let him know. Obviously we already have the party like sorted out for tonight. Uh, so we're gonna have her come down and make a little like cat uh, pumpkin. Okay, here's the pumpkin that, let me just turn off move objects. There we go. Here's the pumpkin that Carlos carved. Very good, very good. This is what we like to see. Let's have Alistair carve one as well. Oh yeah, he has loads of them. Uh, what does this scary one look like? No. I think maybe owl. I feel like owl is quite cute. Let's have him do the owl. All right, Sophia's gonna carve one of her own as well. Did he not get it? Oh, that's for wearing a costume. Oh, because I got rid of the spooky spirit one. I'm, I'm an idiot. Okay, well, it is what it is. You can put on a costume then. You can be... I feel like you would wear a cheerleader costume because you keep wearing your... You keep going to your... Going on your daughter's, like, little cheerleading mat. So you definitely would be going over there. And so you definitely would be wearing that costume. Okay, let's have them help upgrade the treehouse with a bell. What do, you, what do these little girls need? Uh, she wants to get a communication, communication skill up a bit more. So let's have her come and hug Larfy. We should, that should hopefully do it. What are her other first? Read first book, first childhood friend, and study shapes. Maybe we'll have her play with her sister for a bit. Talk about toys. Yeah, the two of them definitely need to have a bit of fun. Give her a hug. Look at how cute they are. Honestly, like, I really appreciate what this pack brought, you know? And also, like, I'm getting a bit more used to the mess that this... Oh, is he passing out? Nope, he's not. Okay, good. Ooh, that looks cute. Good job, Alistair. I mean, obviously, you are a professional at all kinds of handy things. So, of course, you would do well. And he's a perfectionist? Oh, no, it's just from an excellent creation. Good for you. So, oh, masterpiece. Wow, I didn't know you could get, like, masterpiece pumpkins. They're worth so much money. We definitely need to sell that once it's once we're, like, done, you know, with Halloween. 100%. Ooh, do we invite Johnny over? And she's in with her pumpkin as well. Let's have a look at that one. Cute, cute, cute. Okay, yeah, maybe we'll have her come and uh, invite Johnny Zest in. How are you doing, Johnny? Just so you know, I just got into uni. Ah. Um, yeah, do we have like a little bit of small talk, like asking him about his day? We don't really care, but we're just trying to be nice, you know? Maybe she'll make a little fruit salad for brunch. Okay, Matthew met Rebecca at school. And she looks cute. I don't know who Rebecca is. Let's have a look at his. Rebecca, where is Rebecca? Is Rebecca here? Oh, she's right, the first one. Okay, interesting. All right. Uh, okay. She's just doing some dishes, taking care of stuff. All right, you can come down here and play. Let's have you, ooh, you can exercise. I didn't know you can exercise on it. Is it just like regular exercise? Probably, right? Maybe let's have him play pretend. Ooh, okay, he's gonna put on a costume, of course. Let's see, what costume would you? Oh, this is gonna be one of those, isn't it? We have to be Yoda because if you just do a sausage, the costume doesn't actually work. So let's have him come play pretend that he's a space explorer. That makes sense. Plus, with the things that we actually have down on there, it makes it just makes the most sense to do that, you know? Uh, okay, the little girls, how are they doing? Do they have, like, a first friend? Or does it have to be, like, not a sibling? It probably has to be, like, a different child, right? Not related to them. Okay, uh, Lana, you could probably go to sleep, couldn't you? You're quite tired. Can we have her try to read? Because obviously, like, it says, like, oh, read first book. But she can't read a book, right? Let's give them each one book. 
and have them both do the same thing. What did that say? Oh, book now. Love it. Let's have them both do that and then put them to sleep. They should also put on some costumes. That'd be cute. Oh, Monster. I think they'll both just be monsters, really. There we go. She made some fruit salad. Was that good? Excellent. You go, girl. You're actually trying, you know? That's what matters most. And she needs to get a conflict resolution up. Uh, trying to help fix bad relationships. Does anyone have a bad relationship? Does Johnny have a bad relationship with anyone? Can we try to help you? Please, 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 please. I don't know. I tried to find it. Couldn't. So we're just going to have her come up and practice her debate for sure. She wants to go to uni fully prepared. Uh, by the way, I downloaded some new, not some new lots, but some lots from the gallery um, for like the two residential places, um, like the two halls. I'm not sure which one we're going to go to yet. Um, I think I have one that I prefer just because it has a little bit more to it. But we'll see when the actual time comes and if we have enough money for it. Because obviously, obviously that's a big part of it. Any kids come to the house yet to trick or treat? I haven't seen anyone. I know it's like early because obviously, you know, kids would normally finish school at this time. But still, like, because they're off school today. So you would think that, you know, they would be able to just come out. And just come out and uh, trick or treat at any time of the day, but apparently not. Okay, Matthew's almost done with school and he is so, so exhausted. Like, look at him. But that's what he gets for going out clubbing on a Tuesday night. Like, who does that? Actually, like, like what? who actually goes clubbing on a Tuesday night, you know? But he's gonna go to sleep now. He met someone else, Ezran. Interesting hairstyle. Uh, once Alistair is done eating, I think we're going to have him go and upgrade some more of the, the bits that we need to... Oh, he's done. That was quick. Okay, are the girls sleeping? Oh, look at her being a little monster. You can go to sleep. Are you... You're Lizzie, so you need to go to sleep there. And you go to sleep here. Because this is your bad girl. Okay, there we go. Ooh, our strong friendship got me thinking about how we should be... How we got... Jesus Christ. Okay. How strong friendship got me thinking about how we should live together. Can I move in? Uh, sorry, Johnny, but we don't actually have space in this house. Uh, can we tell you, like, hey, girl, sorry? Is he gone? No, he's still here. Can we apologize to him? Because obviously, you know, we don't mean it, like, in a bad way. But it's just, like, we can't do all that. We don't have space in this house. Oh, oh okay. Sure, Megan. Of course. You're lovely. Let's give her a hug. She definitely deserves a hug. She always helps us the most. Let's not do that. Maybe ask her, let's discuss some interests. Uh, ask her about her day. You know, just see how things are going. Uh, how are the kids? How's the family? And maybe just gossip a little bit and see what she knows about the world. You know, what's going on. Tell us all the tea. Okay, we're gonna have him come here and do the slide for sure. And she's gonna go to cheerleading practice. Nope, she's not skipping it. Just go, girl. Oh, I didn't finish it as well. It's just at 75. Oh, but she's getting it, right? Oh, she must, she has to get it. Uh, she will practice hard for sure. We'll see if we if she gets it, but she needs to get it. I really hope she does. I'll be upset if she doesn't. Ooh, what's this? Made a self-discovery. Oh, from learning a new trait. Cool. Okay. Right, you're gonna do some of these dishes. Oh, we can't throw that away because we don't have a trash can. That looks like a trash can. Let's just replace that because we don't have the time or the will to be doing all that. Oh, there you go. Is this a trick-or-treater? Why can't we do it? Can you do it? Yeah, he can. Why didn't Carlos do it? Oh, he can. Treat. Let's get... Quickly, please. Before she goes away. Uh, sure. Yes. He will go to prom with you. This does not look like a teenager. Like, you look like a full-on adult woman. Alright. Clean that up. Are you done playing, boy? 
Don't you have a bell now? What can you do with the bell? I wonder. Maybe it just gets you, like, you can call people over or something. Okay, birthday party started. And as you can see, Sophia actually got her promotion. Thank goodness. Okay, Carlos is just gonna make some cake. Because otherwise, we are not doing it. Uh, I'm... I'm not sure about the whole graduating early thing. Like, does that mean that we're not going to be able to go to... Can I have her, like, go to the computer and be like, graduate now. So we can actually go to uni tomorrow. Do you know what I mean? Okay, let's have a look. Where would that be? Uh, career? Nope. S high school? Graduate early. All right. We're definitely going to go and do that. All right, then. Uh, she's gonna try to graduate early and see if that works out or not. I have no idea if it's going to. I hope it does. Okay, ooh! She read her first book, she actually got it. Okay, good. And in Master Potty Training, you will definitely do that, girl, don't you worry. She read her first book as well. Uh, let's have them both go use the potty then. I mean, she doesn't need to use the potty, but she could do with going to the potty. Let's go. Go do it, girl. Uh, she will not be able. She will be able to get a head start in her early career, but will not get to attend the graduating ceremony. That's fine because you know what? She's gonna become a high a high school student. She's gonna just go to uni straight up. Congratulations, Sophia has graduated high school early. She has shown such such exemplary academics and extracurriculars that she earned a diploma while still being a teen. Graduating early means that Sophia may begin a career earlier and get a head start for professional growth if she chooses to. That's actually really, really good. I don't remember. It will come in the mail. I don't remember. Oh, it's sad that we didn't get this. Because we would have gotten that trait. Mm, it's fine. She's doing so well for like herself. Like She doesn't need to do any better, you know? Like She's just amazing. Let's add some birthday candles to this. Beautiful cake. Oh, here's Miss Cassandra. She's a young... She's a young adult now. Wow, I was not expecting that. I just keep forgetting that everyone just obviously is aging up as we are. Oh, her boyfriend's here. I think we're gonna have to age him up as well, you know? We're 100% gonna have to age him up. So it's gonna be both of our birthdays today, actually. Juan and Sofia. Okay, she's gonna also change her outfit because you had your party outfit on and that's what she's gonna have on. There you go, here he is. Give him a little kiss. Or give him a like a celebratory hug, whatever. There you go. Very cute. And now let's have her make a wish. Ooh. Oh god, no. Matthew's like, nah, I'm good. I don't want to be your boyfriend. I'm just having fun, you know? Can we apologize? Where is she? Here she is. Can we apologize? Admire courage. Sure. He's like, I'm not a complete monster, you know? Oh, he really needs a shower. Oh, and here's mom. Why is she just straight up grabbing food? That's not very professional, mom. Not very nice of you to just come into our house, even though we invited you. And just grab food out of the fridge, you know? It's not for you. And it's birthday time. Birthday, birthday, birthday time. Let's see how it goes. Let's go, Sophia. Happy birthday! Woo! Oh, and she's gonna age up now. There we go. She got four of her little, like, um, parenthood traits, whatever these are called, I don't remember. Uh, I think this looks like the same. And we're gonna give her another trait. Let's have a look and see what there is and see if there's anything new that we want to give her from the new pack. Hmm. Loyal. Is that from? Yeah, I think that's from Thingy, right? Yeah. But I think we had something in mind. Did we have something in mind? Um, no, I think it was just that. Yeah, I think we were trying to go give her Loyal. Because she's obviously had some, like, issues with, like, oh, does he, you know, with Juan. Like, oh, does he actually love me? You know, all this kind of stuff. So, 
yeah, I think we're going to give her that. And we're going to give her the academic um, aspiration. Look at her. I wonder if mom's going to give us a gift. Obviously not. Maybe let's give her a little, like, um, hug, I guess. Hi, mom. Thank you for finally showing up. Uh, let's ask her how she's been, I guess. Uh, ask you about your day. Get to know. I love that they have an interaction to get to know each other. Nothing. Like, it really just tells you. Oh, someone ate cake. Juan. We were supp supposed to, like, sing you a happy birthday with that cake, too. Damn it. Okay, come on and make another cake. Because we need to sing happy birthday to him. I'm not having this whole drama. Absolutely not. Okay, girl, are you okay? Did you get something else? Nope. Okay, just go back to sleep then. Go on. Uh, he's having a little dance, Matthew is. Who, who is that? Oh, that's... What is he doing, though? Is he just, like, talking to himself? Very cute. Okay. Uh, Matthew, do you want to put on a costume once you're done showering? He is n nasty, 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 dirty. There we go. Let's give him the Space Ranger costume just to make sure that we get that. Uh, where has he gone? Are they both sitting in the same seat? Okay, there we go. They've moved over now. Uh, that's Juan, actually. So many of these teens are now young adults. Like, come on, people. Maybe he's gonna... Oh, okay. Where is he then? Okay, he's talking to him. He's talking to his friend. Let's have her do some of these dishes. She has so many traits. Wow. Cheer champion. She gets... She gets what? Okay, wait a second. I want to be a ninja when I grow up. Who is he talking to, though? He doesn't seem to be here, but he also is not in the bathroom, is he? Maybe let's just... Um, say that start practice your hiding. Oh, he is asking him. Okay. Well, anyway. Cheer. She gains fitness skill faster. That's cool. Uh, she also sees some career boosts for this uh, graduating early. Cool. She's really doing the best, isn't she? She wants to chat with her crush. So she's going to have a little chat with Juan. Yeah, now this is a bit of like a complicated situation, isn't it? Where's the cake? Why is it here? Add birthday candles before anyone touches it. And let's have... Uh, Juan, hey, jump. Juan, let's go. Oh, here's a uh, title. <laughs> One of the strangest names. I don't know what happened with this, but... You know, it is what it is. Let's have him joke around... Grab some cake. Here we go. Juan is aged up. She wants. She's gonna come down and give him a big get hug and a kiss. Oh, not propose. I know, like that. Express our devotion. Express our devotion, not express. Oh, she wants to chat. And I think I'm going to have them have their first woohoo. She wants to wear a costume. Let's put, a, let's put a costume on. Let's do it. Just for like... Just for the sake of it, you know. And let's have them have her woohoo with Juan. Uh, please? Today? Juan? Do you know... Let's Marvin Gaye get it on. Oh, I love that they're such good friends. You know, I really like enjoy the, their friendship. He is not doing great though. So he's going to come out here and go to the toilet. Stop all of that. And then go take a shower. What's going on with the babies? What's going on? What's wrong with you? You want some food? Probably not cake, but I guess you could probably have this cake, right? Because it's like sugar free. So it shouldn't count as like a dessert, right? <laughs> I don't actually know. Okay, let uh, Lizzie out. Is everyone happy? You haven't put on a costume yet. So let's have you do that now. He's going to do a little maid costume because why not? 
and Mr. Salvador is gonna come out here and um, moonbathe? Oh, stargaze, yes. Can we not start stargaze by ourselves? I don't think we can, right? Nope. Okay, well, he needs to go to the toilet, so I'm just gonna have him teleport up here. Just to save a bit of time, you know? Did they... They didn't go. Oh. Oh, because Juan's gone home. Well, it is what it is. Just go to sleep, girl, honestly. You did your best. He's exhausted, so he's gonna go to sleep. Um, Alistair, can you leave the girls alone, please? Uh, just put Lizzie to sleep. Uh, Lana's gonna come sleep as well when she's done eating her cake. Is she gonna eat it? Please eat your cake. And Carlos is gonna come stargaze. Where would that be? Activities? Let's have them both come out and see. Let's let me try to find it. I'll be back in a second. There we go. Ask, ask the Stargaze is in deep thoughts for some reason. Oh, yes. Yes, they are close. I mean, their relationship is very high. Oh, yeah, I love it. Okay, everyone was very happy and very successful, etc. Oh, I'm glad they're so close, you know? Like, obviously, that's the whole point of all of this. But it's just the cutest thing that they are close, you know? Just so lovely. Okay, what's going on, girls? What's going on? She's not loving life. Okay, go to sleep. And you go to sleep. Leave the girls alone. Repair this, and then go to sleep, actually. Uh, and you go to sleep when you finish with your cake. I don't care if you're, like, feeling energized or whatever. Just do what I'm telling you. Let's see if we can stop, right? Yep. Yeah. Sleep in a treehouse for six, for six hours. We're definitely going to have him go and do that. Uh, enclosure, sleep. And we're going to have Carlos come in here, clean up the house a bit, and then go to sleep. He's feeling inspired from being closely connected. Oh, I love that. And also from stargazing. Oh, he was startled by his dad's ghost. Oh, Babe. Uh, I think you're fine, right? You don't really need to eat now. You can eat in the morning. All right, guys. I think we're going to have Sophia just quickly enroll into uni. And once we actually pick where we want to go, we're going to end the part there. And then in the next episode will be Sophia's first day of uni. So I'll see you in a minute. All right, here we are. She wants to get engaged and ask uh, Juan out. Love it. All right, here we are applying for uni. Enrolling, I mean. And let's see how that goes. We also got to give her a little makeover. Yes, she needs a little adult makeover. So we're definitely going to go to University of Bychester because first of all, you have the debate guild that she wants to join. So it's the appropriate one, really. 
and then also the degree that she wants. So with art history, what can we get? Critic, communications. I feel like this is what she would go for. Yeah, realistically, that's the one that she would actually go for. History, maybe? Not really. I don't know if she would go into, polit into politics, you know? I feel like if anything, she would go into like charity organizer and that kind of thing, you know? Yeah. I think that's what we're going to have her do. We're going to have her do communications. She will do three classes and let's do an elective in... I feel like she would do parenting, you know? Because she definitely wants to be a mom. So she would... Oh, God. This is the one I wanted to go with. Uh, I think we're going to go for it. I know it's 800, but we also got our, our um, Jesus. Imagine if we didn't have this. That's 800 out of it. But I guess I still got to pay for everything else. Well, yeah, we're just going to have the, her do it. Let's go. And yeah, so this is our new household. Let's, we're going to give her like 200 simoleons. We're like, um, girl, we don't have money. You know how it is. Okay, this is exciting. So we're gonna just move her in, pick her room, and then give her a makeover, and that'll be the end of the episode. Oh, goodness. This is all very exciting. It's been a while since I've played a sim through uni as well. I usually just do uni from home, like when I'm playing, because I can't be bothered with all the walking, you know, that they have to do to go to class. Here we are, not you in your pajamas, girl. Absolutely not. Okay. Um. Yeah, I think this is the one that I was like, oh, this would be good for her. You know, got a nice little mirror. We got a bedroom. It's quite tidy. There's books. Then this, like, her roommate would be a bit messy. So, yeah, I think we're going to get this room, this bedroom for us. For sure. And I'm going to see if I can get some uni students as well. Uh, like, for this world. Or just, you know, in general, whatever. And she has class. Oh, she has class tomorrow. Yeah. She has three classes tomorrow. Jesus. Okay. That's going to be a lot of homework to do. Okay. Well, we're just going to go off into create a sim now. And give Sophia her makeover. So, I hope you all enjoyed this part. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.
Yeah. 